Okay, uh, just going to show you the garden. Um, we're trying to get back garden then. Um, with what's been going on and all the hours we're working, um, one thing or another, uh, the bushes and that are overgrown. But we're going to cut them all out and change the garden. So what I'm going to do is show you around. Um, sorry about the noise, but someone's doing some um, work over the back as well. <laughs> As you can see, as you come out the door, you've got this massive bush. Um, there's another one there. You've got all the weeds growing in it too, which doesn't help. And this is the bottom left. Um, as you can see, it's quite bad now. To the corner, to the garage. I want to change the garage door as well. Um, I don't know if you can see, but there's a, one of our cats sat down there in between. Um, the pond's still going to leak, so I've got empty that. But we're going to clear all this and we will be making a bigger pond. Um, the pond are in a um, paddling port at the moment. Um, and the pump is broke on that now, so I'm not having a lot of luck lately. Uh, we're also changing the fence panels, they're going to be changed. As I said, the door's going to be changed in the shed. So what I'm going to do is show you as we go, and um, we'll show you what we've done today. And we'll try and see you know, how it goes. As I said, all the weeds grow fast, it's all overgrown, it's just got bad. Um, we just want somewhere nice to sit. And as I said, we don't have a lot of time in that, so this is what the beginning is going to look like. And let's see what the end looks like. Okay, so you saw the garden earlier, with all the bushes down the side. So this is end of day one. It's going to take a little bit longer than we want to. But at least it'd be worth it in the end. Obviously that's the pile, one lot of piles of bushes, but you can see the difference there. Look at the tree, cut some branches off and took it so it's a bit lighter in the garden. And there's the rest of the bushes. Now this, this is all got, all these bushes have got to go into the skip. The pond's looking a little bit, I mean it's got to have a new line out of the puncture anyway, um, or a leak. Um, but you can see I put all the stuff in there because we're still doing that and it started raining so, you know, it's getting late, going to give it a... Um, end of night because I've got to go to work early in the morning um, as I said I'm going to change that uh, that's the our makeshift pond that we had to do because we had the leak um, which is all good uh, it's looking a little bit dirty I don't know if you see the fish just then it's starting to look a bit green because it's in the sun all the time so it really wants sorting out so yeah that's how far we've got so far I mean you know it definitely looks a lot different um, so all that's going down a tip or in the skip the skip's coming next week and then uh, we'll go from there so hopefully it's all going to look good so we will speak to you again soon and show you um but I said, uh, that's how we're going so that's that's day one end of day one okay i thought i'd just show you what i'm up against um as you see there's a big root going back there towards the bushes and tree. We've got roots over there. Um, I think you can see uh, roots here, root there. There's roots absolutely everywhere in this pond. Um, it's filled with old carpets, so I've still got carpets to get out. And uh, it's a white mess. So that's what I've got to do, get all these roots out. And this isn't going to be I knew it was going to be hard, but it's going to be hard enough for, um, as I said, a massive route there, going up there. Um, so I've got my work cut out without a doubt. Uh, that's all the rocks I've pulled out so far, there's still loads of there, I've got to sort out. Um, and as I pulled them bushes out, the fence is starting to fall down, so yeah, it definitely needs doing. Um, so yeah, at the moment it's looking better, but it's still looking very, very rough. But I just thought I'd show you quick, you know, still got a lot, I mean I cleared all the bushes out, but so this is the beginning of day two, um, and what I'll do is I'll show you a bit later, but uh, 
we've certainly got a lot to do. Um, and the other thing is the pond's getting filled in. Uh, we decided to have a, um, a raised pond. So we're going to have a raised pond. But, um, yeah, a couple of sheds to go in. Um, obviously the decking's got to go in. So, yeah, it's looking better, but <laughs> not so better. But yeah, so, so it's all cleared. So it looks a lot better. The garden's a lot better. Um, in a sense bigger but I've certainly got my work cut out here um, as I said uh, most people line it with sand they've lined it with carpet so and, uh, rocks in the bottom and all sorts but as I said I am filling that in so we'll see how it goes so I'll speak to you again later okay okay so we're doing an update um, this is uh, finished day two as you can see, I've got some more um, rubbish in the garden, which will be going out in the skip tomorrow. Um, we're taking loads of the roots out, some already in the skip, so all this part has been cleared. Got one over there to take out, one there, and one over there. And then what we've got to do is we've got to clear this corner, which we haven't done yet. Um, part of the fence started to fall down, that's the neighbour's fence that's already up there, so we're putting that one along here anyway. And the pond, as you can see, is nearly full, um, filling it back up. Like I said, we're going to do a raised pond, we decided. And then the um, sheds will be along here, uh, not sure yet, probably decking there, raised pond that side, but we're not completely sure. Um, there's our cat, or one of. So I say, still quite a bit to go out. Um, some bags of uh, weeds and stuff, um, all got going to skip. So yeah, it looks still, you know, a lot to do. Um, bits and pieces everywhere. Um, obviously the makeshift fish pond, which has gone green and all uh, a bit horrible. But um, yeah, so that's the situation so far. So that's day one and two. And we'll speak to you um, again soon. So I hope you like the video and what I've done. Um, if you do, please like and subscribe. And um, do tell me whether you're doing your garden and how you got on and any points that you can put me in. Uh, yeah, it's coming along. So thanks very much for watching, as I said.